It's like Halloween, you know? Oh, that's fine. What? It's all the time. What? <laughs> what, you... what? What? Oh, Laura was just pointing at something. I see. A wine stain on the floor that I made. How did you get a job? You smell like shit. You smell, wine shit. Shit. You smell like shit. How did you get a job? My room always smells like wine. <laughs> I killed every morning. I wake up and I, I drink. I drink a glass of red wine. It gets me energized for the for the day ahead of me. I wash. I wash my skin. I bathe in red wine. I bathe. I bathe in a, in a in a trough of red wine like a pig. Man, it doesn't matter. She's fifteen, my nigga. I like young girls. I like them fifteen, fourteen, sixteen. I like them real young, my nigga. I don't like them. I don't like women in twenty. All the girls in the twenties, I'm cool with a girl. I like fucking girls like fifteen. <laughs> Welcome to the Hour Cafe podcast. Woo! Welcome back. I'm all, we're on a heel. Seven or eight, something. The, ha the Halloween special has arrived. <laughs> Scary things you have to listen to my voice. Scary things you have to listen to Connor's voice from the, the next room over. The scariest thing is, is Tiger has been doing heal for the past past week and has been doing really nasty shit in the toilet. Yeah, reminds me of a story Aiden told me. It's uh. Um, where he had a protein smoothie from Boost, and he said he shat and farted like crazy bad because protein makes your fart smelly, smelly. Okay, yeah. so we don't have a video portion, but Tig here is 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 a is in the Halloween, bro. darkness with Halloween decoration lights around him with his Can shirt just off, up photo? drinking a glass of wine. <laughs> Uh, it's, like a, it's like a it's like a creepy pasta, like a like some. This, this, so like, oh, we should read creepy pasta. It's like some Marvel Hornet shit right I'm here. Find some... a creepy pasta to fucking read. Yeah, it's so boring give though. A, give yeah, me a topic, was... and I'll try and see. I'll just uh, give me a topic anyway. And I'll just try and like, see. If that's like that's like early FFP shit. Yeah, but that's kind of cute. Kind of cute, but you know. If you just like give me any topic, and I'll see if there's a creepy pasta of it. Like any property or something like that. Uh, my brain's fried. Someone okay. else, someone else, think of something. All right. Uh, do poppy play? To, no, that's oh, that's, 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 that's a horror oh. thing. It's gonna be. Only plays creepy I can't think. I'm looking uh, at only plays creepy pasta. Yeah, do that. <laughs> so fucking stupid. That's what I said about your mom, but, the, but, you know, I gave her a second chance. Yeah, it's just the Game Boy, the Game Boy Advance SP Blue Edition Creepypasta. Good enough. Is there, no, is there a Yeek Creepypasta? Yeah, probably. Hold on. Plucking my eye, my little, little monobrow hairs right now, that's the scariest thing of all. That's right. <laughs> Let's talk about the eyebrows. I they're scary. Cut the sh wax them shits off. Uh, I do. <laughs> okay, wax your eyebrows off. Uh, I do. I was I was my eyebrows off. I'm not getting creepy pastas. Any creepy pastas? Okay, maybe I was wrong. Maybe they aren't creepy. Start everything. Yeah. 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 Really interesting. I was I was, I was plucking my eyebrows. I pluck a little bit too much off the side. Of my, I I was my plucking. Head. I was plucking my eyebrows. No, you don't don't want everything like. I know. When I went to pluck one of the hairs, I felt a strange twinge, like a sharp pain ringing through my fucking ears. Tags reconnecting with his creepy cat roots, right? And then now. when my mom walked into my room and spoke to me, I couldn't hear her. I was deaf. My mom had no eyebrows. My do, mother. Do, 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 do. They were all gone. My mother canceled my Twitch Prime. Spoiler, he, he plucked I cannot, a, I cannot finish plucked, Rings of Power on, on, on Amazon Prime. <laughs> he plucked the hearing nerve. <laughs> like the hearing nerve in his eyebrows? He can't, he can't hear Rings of Power. Have you ever God. heard that, that, uh, that urban myth part. about like the getting your ears pierced and then seeing like a thread in the ear piercing and then you pull it and it turns out you pulled an exposed nerve ending? It's not. And it's like... Ear piercing. It's but that's not. It's not like where you. It wouldn't. That wouldn't. I know, but that was an hearing. urban myth. 
the white string was an urban myth they used, I guess, to like discourage girls from getting their ear pierced. It's like a Japanese one, That's um, and it made it kids get a fr- it, fuck. I don't. Know. Did they say it, it made, made them it. deaf, or it would just would just hurt? No, no, it didn't make them deaf. It's a, a young girl desperately wanted to get her ears pierced. Her parents said she was too young, but she pleaded with them, saying that all the other girls in her class had pierced ears. Bet, I, did Junji Ito? do a drawing thing of this uh eventually her parents relented and agreed to let her do it they gave her some money and told her to go to the local mall and get her ears pierced in a jewelry store instead oh, i gotta do my crew pasta voice instead the girl decided to keep the money and do the piercing herself Ooh. she got her best friend to help her do it they heated up a large needle and stuck it through both the girl's earlobes <gasps> it was oh, quite man. painful but in the end, her ears were pierced. She was delighted to be able to wear earrings. However, a few days later, the girl was in school when she began to feel a pain in her left ear. Her earlobe was extremely itchy. During break time, she went into the bathroom and looked in the mirror. Her earlobe was red and inflamed. She began scratching at it. When she looked closely, she saw what looked like the end of a piece of white string sticking out of the hole in her earlobe. Thinking it was very strange, she started picking and pulling at it. After a few minutes, there was a long piece of white string hanging out of her pierced earlobe. There didn't seem any end to it. Finally, she got a pair of scissors and cut the string. Everything went black. She couldn't see. What? All right, that's all right. Hold up, no, hold the no, phone. No, no, that's that's that oh, there's a beetle sense. in my room. That's pretty spooky. There's a beetle. What? There's been a lot of beetles around. No, uh, front apparently door. she that cut that an optic sense. nerve in her ear. In her ear, yeah, in her ear. Don't worry about it, man. No, don't I'm, worry. Just I, don't no, I'm no science. No, I'm no science you bitch. Get your but ears. That's but I don't think you know. If it, in my head, that don't make no sense. I'm no scientist, yeah. though, but, you know. Well, ask the girl. She's blind, man. I don't know. She'll, she'll tell you differently. I think... Oh, this beetle, bro. What the fuck? I think having PSD is kind of like... Like, you okay. know... No, it's just kind of like, you know... Maybe, maybe I'm disillusioned because I've had my ears pierced since I was, like, 12 or something, or 11. But it's just so... It's so, like, not cool. No, you know it's fucking I mean? rad, dude. Your ear lobes are just sort of like... Yeah, they're just good. I've, I've had... I, I was looking at all the photos on, on my Google photos of me, and I, I think I've worn the same ear piercings in my ear since I was like 13, and just never taken them out. Because like, cause like, who... I don't know. Who cares that much? <laughs> They've become because they've they've defined that you find out your your ear pieces become fused with your skin. No, I've you taken get... them out before. It's not <laughs> got fused. That's a new <laughs> creepy car. Like creepy. Can I make a new creepy pasta on the spot? No, I <laughs> take them out to clean them sometimes, but I'm just. Saying, I took my piercings out to clean them. I'm saying as anyway, a piercing, like like I, I know wanted they're to like take you know a known out. thing, but like in in effect, they're just sort of whatever. I you wanted know. to take my piercings out to clean them. Jesus fucking. Yeah, that's that's the whole creepy past there. And then they didn't come off. <gasps> <gasps> I, I looked down at the the <gasps> new uh, really neon neon, neon yellow smiley okay face piercings I just bought at Levisa. <laughs> I cannot wear these now. <laughs> That's no. a real there. Fuck! <laughs> no! No, 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 no. Yeah. Anyway. That's an so been... so yeah, we, the, so the, been... the ear piercings that don't come out, yeah. SCP? The ear piercings that come out, yeah. The ear yeah. piercings don't come out. My ear piercings don't come out. I can't wear my 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 vintage uh, retro gaming Pac-Man ear piercings, where one of them is Pac-Man and one of them is the Red Ghost. Fuck. <laughs> See, I want to. I I want them to do Daredevil. Oh, they redo his origin to make that he just you know he he did his ear piercings by himself <laughs> and then he became Daredevil. Yeah, he probably oh, pulled, pulled, pulled an optic nerve and he's like, fuck, <laughs> I have to fight crime now. Yeah, I have to fight fucking crime now. God. <laughs> 
So we've been, we've been consuming any real like. But he's like very he's ve- he's very dedicated to stopping kids from piercing their own ears. Whoa. Yeah, hey, that's the whole. Whoa. Yeah, and, he, and, he pay, and then he pays for the kids to get their ears professionally pierced. Mm-hmm. Yeah, Den- Denji pulling on the optic nerve on his chest to come <laughs> <laughs> chase my man. <laughs> What if he pulled on the court? And then just, just, like, go, just goes blind and then he's just, just kill the zombie, just kill him again. And then Puchita's like, you fucking idiot, that was just yeah, a nerve ending. That's just, <laughs> I don't give you any cool powers, bro, that's just an exposed nerve ending, dude. <laughs> you fucking dumbass. When he actually uh, tries to use Puchita, he pulls on it, but he just... <laughs> <laughs> It's not a ripcord, dude. That's fucking nerve. He just he just tears Pachita out through his chest <laughs> and just fills a big hole in his fucking leg. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, psych, that's actually what I wanted you to do, bitch. Pachita! I am a cyst. I am a tumor. <laughs> I'm a tumor. I'm a tumor. He has a hard lump in his chest. He sees the doctor. Dummy. <laughs> I mean... He really hurts. I don't want to. I don't want... Oh, it's, it's an ingrown hair. It's an ingrown hair. It's a massive oh, ingrown hair. Doctor Pimple Buffer is on it. Shades of hair, but it was just a giant ingrown hair. Just shoots. They call him Pimp. They call him fucking ingrown hair man. <laughs> <laughs> the ingrown hair devil. <laughs> that would totally be a devil too. The ingrown hair devil. <laughs> no one wants an ingrown hair. Fuck, they suck. I got I got two ingrown hairs and, and like the the inside of my thigh. Like I fucked up. I couldn't. I forgot to moisturize. Everyone's reaction when he they shows up is just. Oh, oh, oh. No, they can't. They hurt, but they... everyone's you're, reaction when they're like a massive is like... pussy. They hurt. Oh, 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 you, oh, you're a massive oh. pussy. You know, just like love pluck. You know, to be fair, I didn't like plucking the hairs out. You know, yeah, it's kind you, of cool. you get tweezers and you get to dig in that shit. Especially like it, it comes out it's like really long. Yeah, as it's well. like a giant like long hair. It's like ooh, and then you, and then you like put it in your mouth and give it a little taste. I don't do I that. I like it when you pull it out and 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 you pull it out and and there's like a whole like uh, like funny little spiral that comes mm-hmm. out with it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, and and in the spiral, you see like these little balls that are like moving around at a very fast speed. Yeah, I don't know what they are, but when I touch them, they make they like they send little funny tingles through my hands, mm-hmm. and then I I forget things. Okay, cool. <laughs> That's I just cool. pull out no, so good. Any, <laughs> any, anyone doing anything like you know spooky this Halloween? Anyone like you know, it's spooky? It's spooky this Halloween. Uh, 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 I no. <laughs> I I, I I always like I always try and dress up the podcast every Halloween to be like oh it's so like fun and festive I I actually I don't really enjoy Halloween I love Halloween it's my favorite yeah. time of the year I find it kind of shit Hey bad tech Prezo insert a insert a um big booing sound effect in here just because you called me prezzo i'm not doing that <laughs> banjo banjo instead of big booing sound effect down here and have the words bad take bad take come up okay now it gets to come up <laughs> now you get to do it uh no no i don't uh, like yeah. what i i i, I planned stuff. i planned to stream a bunch of horror games on twitch and youtube and i didn't no, that's that's the extent of uh, of my Halloween shit. Yeah, it's but it's time. that it's that and editing the, the fucking Robo Cafe Halloween video. I kind of forgot, I, I kind of forgot that it was Halloween today. Like legit, it was gonna be Halloween soon. Well, yeah, it's not Halloween. Uh, today. Oh, that's, that's why I correct myself. I have like, to fucking I forgot, I forgot Halloween. of of October. I have to work I, on Halloween. Yeah. Fuck. I guess someone had to do it, but I'm gonna be sitting there. I- I'm gonna come to work in full white face paint and like black around my eyes. And if anyone asks me, I'm just gonna be like, I don't know what you're talking about. Yeah, yeah. I'm just gonna see what happens. I'm gonna see if I would get in. Tr- would I get in trouble for doing that? It's Halloween, bitch. Maybe I could hand in my resignation. With that. <laughs> 
resigning. The scariest thing of all. I'm getting out of here. I'm oh, resigning. Yeah. Full crow. Go <laughs> full crow if you resignation. Yeah. <laughs> Working here has 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 made me a. Uh, I've endured a lot of stress working here that has caused me to grow pale and 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 not sleep. I look like working this. Here, now. I'm a ghost now. Working here is actually <laughs> fuck you guys. He has killed me. <laughs> I haunt the premises now. Yeah, I entered it and I just died. Uh, yeah. I, I, like, I like the I like the imagery of someone walking into a shop and the second they put their foot in, they just collapse and die. It's like they've entered a fucking forbidden boundary or something. So, uh, so, so, so anyone been, uh, been gaming? Yeah, but... I've been, I've been gaming a little bit. I've been gaming. I've been gaming a lot, actually. I have not played, played Persona 5 Royal for, like, fucking days in a row. Just he's like, been, non-stop. well, he's been, he's been in an insane of few it's, days. It, I've played 70.5 hours of this point. Oh my god, that's so fucked up, man. <laughs> I've I've just been a really sick. Have you, eat, have you eaten food? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I I just usually the thing is I just usually leave the game running whenever I eat. I you only eat your sustenance juice. Yeah, yeah. You I, I, I like is this you? Is you? Fucking. Connor, Connor, my soylent. I just turn it off when I go to bed. Do you like what? vegetable juice, Connor? I like vegetable juice. Yeah. 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 yeah fucking lying. I reckon you're lying. Well, why? Why would I lie? Well, I bought vegetable juice. I drank some today. I was like, because uh, they were like, it was like very oh, like oh. cheap at Woolworths, the V8. And I'm like, fuck it, I'll buy this one. Didn't read what was on it. I opened it today, take a sip, and it's just salty. And I fucking, and it I don't was like just V8. tomato, celery, and carrot. That was all. I don't like V8. Was. I like other brands. I used to think that V8 and VB were like the same company. What? <laughs> No, I thought are. I thought that they made V8 and VB, and I was like, "Yeah, it's the healthy." You can, make, you can mix them together to get the ultimate drink. It's like a, it's like a, it's like a Bloody Mary, but like you know. It's got that well, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna make a Bloody Mary. I'm gonna. You got both v- that. VB. That's gonna be my Halloween drink. <laughs> yeah, make, yeah, make a Before VB Bloody up, Mary. Yeah. Make, yeah, make like a Bloody fucking Mary. make like a fucking like a cocktail video, but like it's like v- VB Bloody Mary. <laughs> it's only VB. I only use VB. <laughs> it's various VB inspired drinks. This one. Oh, the VBV8. The VBait. <sighs> you ever, um. <laughs> no, I can't say. I, I, I uh, understood a word you just said. Um. <laughs> Do, do do you guys ever what what's so what's in the what's in the you know what's in the news? What's in the news? Uh, um, Kanye's doing, doing his thing. Kanye too. as well. Kanye's <laughs> doing his thing. Yeah, uh, I mean, we talked about it last week, but we talked. Oh, you guys talked about last week. Not yeah, last episode. Wanna... Not, we, we didn't look. We didn't he did deny about. the Holocaust now for the update. Yeah, he's he's you know whatever. Classic. He's on his like he's on his like uh, bipolar bender. Kanye, you know, he'll Kanye, yeah, he'll fucking you know in six months he'll be the complete opposite, and then in another six months after that he'll be the same as now. And he just... made graduation, okay? He's always gonna he's always gonna be like that. Yeah. He's a uh, he uh I I you know he's he's fucking psychotic like probably legitimately. Yeah, but more importantly, budget 2022. Everyone cares about Australian politics. I don't give a fuck, Connor, my dude. On a on a quick summary of the budget, go. Uh, it's uh, pretty. You, you, it has a lot of spending, and it cuts down on a lot of a, a lot of rods. No, but it is a bit <laughs> too take a screen cap that right now. Page take screen cap. Hurry. What? It's just kind of targeting chips. Why do I need a screen cap? Screen cap. It's showing screen. I tried the popcorn chicken slap. That shit was insane. Mm. Okay. I, I wanted to hear about the budget, but it, now we're just, you know, I feel like, I feel yeah, like, no uh, like Con got really one. cut off about his, his budget, uh, you know. Oh, like, oh. This actually impacts our life. Con, a budget, go. Hey, popcorn chip and slab also impacts my life. I know. Popcorn, <laughs> I got KFC today and it was dry okay. shit. And I, okay, pop, I mean, I was about to say popcorn chicken slab, go. I mean, budget, go. <laughs> Uh, the budget's pretty good overall. It's way better than, you know, if the liberals were in power. But it is a bit too optimistic that we won't go into recession. And because of that, there is a couple of problems with it. But otherwise, no! it's pretty good. No! Uh, 
it. Yeah, that's, that's that's probably why yeah. the 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 dollar the, the dollar Slurpee is is now dollar fifty. Dollar fifty. Dollar fifty yeah. is a dollar fifty Slurpee. Song. That's what I, that's a wake up call for me. I was like, it's the same at Seven Eleven. The one dollar Slurpee is two dollars now. Yeah, that's why I said. That's why I said. We need. You're, fucking... you're gonna start talking about like Slurpees as if they're a dollar, and then like in ten years, you're you're fucking. Someone's gonna say Slurpees are, like five bucks. It's so fucked up. We need a free grand, like like we got in two thousand and eight. That'll just fix everything. That's so right. <laughs> We need Ke- we need Ke- Kevin 07 back in. Yeah, we got it. We got his junior in. You know, you, you can like control him. You can like possess him. You can like you can puppet him. Oh, I'm going to puppet you now. Okay. Okay, Arbo. Okay, I'm gonna guide you. Now. Kevin I'm, gonna, I'm gonna the one in when, when you run the that? country. Always oh, remember uh, that. I don't always remember Arbo. Remember where you came from. Remember who's in control. So, uh, what do you guys think of daylight savings time? Oh, I, th- oh, I think you started on that shit. Don't get me started on daylight savings. That's gonna send me into a spin. Well, I looked there. outside and it was like it was like six, and I looked outside. And I was like, damn, it's like fully bright out. Why the fuck is you know daylight savings people be like it's like seven for them? But then it got to like six thirty and it was almost fully dark, and I was like, oh no, I kind of get it now. The sun, the sun is down. Penis show. Penis show. <laughs> yeah, Drake. Drake is sort of to summarize my opinion on daylight savings. <laughs> Sun is now. But uh, but you know, I I, I think uh, I I I appreciate being being a, being a strong a headstrong Queenslander. You know. I can't oh, fuck with daylight I can't, savings. I can't fuck with yeah, da- daylight savings are gay. I hate them. I don't really, yeah, I don't really see that much wrong with them, but the yesterday the cops fucking raided the place next to mine. Oh really? Why? I, I don't uh, think you should. T- I don't think you can talk about this, that. This gotta be like, we might, I don't think that's like, something. I mean, that was all I was about. gonna say. But with the like, fucking put the peanuts like like from a sensor sound over it. Wow, wow, wow. Okay. How do you think that bitch gives head? The teacher, like, what? She was like, oh, 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 shit. Bro, us, us talking about peanuts is kind of like in theme for Halloween. You know when Linus found that really big fucking pumpkin? No, I That's haven't seen I, any I, Charlie Brown shit. They didn't pumpkin. air it this year, apparently, and people were upset about that. Yeah, oh, they, were like, <laughs> they were like, dude, what is the fucking crap? Because <laughs> the Charlie. new one was like, the new one they were going to release was finds like finds out he's gay. And well, he, he, no. like it's late at night. It's late at night. And he walks out into the field, and then that's he has a realization that he's gay, and that's the the plot of it. It's not about that. That's the true horror of the situation. And, and that's then, the then that, that's the horror he finds it. It's like I'm, I'm homosexual. Parents really didn't like that one. They really pushed. You know what the real horror of of the world is right now is is the goddamn liberal left. <laughs> Just, just completely Tell me about it, deteriorating the our, our good, our good traditional values. It's the deterioration. The other day, and uh, the cashier was all like, uh, "Do you want a rainbow burger with a freaking pronoun shake?" And I was like, "Hey, how about you take your pronouns and sh- shove it up, 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 up your rear end, Buster?" Now I know we're having a bit of joke, but it's true. Uh, it's something I'm very concerned about mm-hmm. recently, especially the deterioration of the modern man. Yep. Uh, and and what you know, what used to be. There are more um, men eating sir. <laughs> like, there are more men yeah. wearing what happened to men? Things. Because, like, I remember the good old days when men were men, you know? but now we got all these, you know, sissies and these problems. You know, it's like, yeah, uh, yeah, like, just men were were good. You no, know, I mean, you like, know, you name a place that's selling men. stew nowadays. You know what I mean. Exactly. No one's Actually, eating stew. That is a problem. No one's like, eating stew. Like, ratio of, st- ratio no of st- st- yeah, ratio of stew stores to bracelet stores, uh, just fucking staggering now. The realization I actually, is. I actually agree with that point. Like, and not a you, and it's the fact that these men you, are wait, also. Wait, wait, like, wait, Connor. You agree <laughs> with the fact that 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 that? I mean, I I sub. 
If you're talking about statistically, I probably yes, there are more men who have worn a, who are wearing bracelets than eating stew, but I don't really see what that has to do with anything. There are probably I men with bracelets. I, no, I also agree with the implicit point that, that that's bad because I think more people should be eating stew. Just but that's only because you like Stop. stew. You don't think yeah, like we don't, yeah. we don't need your autistic yeah. realism, like your autistic. <laughs> like, yeah, you're, not you're, not sitting here, you're not sitting here like stew will make you a fucking real man. You're like you just like stew. You just think more people should yeah. eat stew because you like it. Uh, yeah, woman, that, uh, let's put the ground that woman shouldn't eat stew. Oh, yeah, I that's not great. Well, I mean, let's I say, is it even eating stew women or make is it drinking stew? stew? It's oh, eating stew. It's a good well, stew, women don't even eat food, you know? Like, they don't, they don't, sh- oh, they that's don't, what I they don't mine. shit. Women I don't, mine. You women don't, don't shit, actually. You don't eat food. They just stand outside all day. Women don't oh, fuck. Cook. Holy they fuck. Poop. I would you make the food, you don't eat it. That's what I say. You make the food, you don't eat it. You eat the food, and then you eating the food makes my food. But um, it is worrying, the deterioration of man. Um, you know, I, And then the men that try to rise up, you know, they get ridiculed and, and, and chastised. Like, I thought the marginalized and the oppressed was supposed to, you know, have a voice, you know. Mm-hmm. Thought we were supposed to protect the marginalized, but obviously not. Yeah, um, free speech is getting yeah, censored. Kanye like said, I mean, normal. Kanye said the white man is the most oppressed, oppressed man yeah. right now. Like, <sighs> uh, don't you love how like these they <laughs> these people... insults, these these casual insults? Don't you love how fucking In- it... these incels, you know, as they like to say. Just keep going. I think it's just a skill issue. I just don't, yeah. <sighs> sorry. I'm sorry to get so emotional about this. It's okay. Yeah, fine. Well, you get it. It's, this is quite you know, I know your t- testosterone makes you emotional, I get it. <laughs> the burns of a man. <laughs> it's just... No, it's the opposite. You guys uh, ever... You, you guys... See, um... Yeah, okay, cool. Back to the budget. Uh, can we not? <laughs> the scariest well, thing of all is the fucking economics of this things. podcast. Ooh. <laughs> we, don't, we don't know how to structure a podcast. Ooh. <laughs> We're spending more money know. on stew and less money on bracelet. <laughs> 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 Elbow came out and said next year's budget will have twice as much allocated for stew and fucking quad and fucking ten percent as as much uh for bracelet spending. He said, and I quote, "This budget's for the boys." <laughs> budget for the boys. And then the, the fucking the treasurer and secretary all came out and went, ooh, 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 and did a shooey. Have they done shoeys in the Parliament House before? Have they? I don't know. They, I'm sure, I, I'm I mean, sure someone you know, has. Like back in the '70s or something. That there's there's something. a lot they do I'm, in the Parliament House. There's yeah. a lot of people that are doing in the Parliament like, House. Great woman. And also I'm, a high I'm, okay. I mean, I don't have a problem with that one. That's pretty cool. Was it? Oh, yeah, I, I don't. Is it yeah. in the Parliament House yeah. itself? Yeah, yeah, it was. Yeah, that's what happened. They hired. Yo, I honestly though, honestly yeah, though, expected. if you were were said prostitute, wouldn't that be the fucking most like awesome job? It wasn't a prostitute. No, I think Connor's talking about a different thing. Oh, you're talking about the prostitutes that got brought into Parliament House. I'm talking yeah. about the, the rape. That I'm saying, I'm saying, if you were yeah, a worker I'm, I'm... in that situation, wouldn't that be the coolest fucking job? Because you're like yeah, stepping into the fucking like you know the Parliament House. You're coming in the in like, the, in oh, the look, oh, like, I was expecting a good job tonight, but fuck, this is like that'd be I'd be I'll, fire. I'd be like I'd be like jawed, but like this is pretty sick. This is like <laughs> like I'm literally getting fucked in like where where like the, the, the most part important decisions in this country are being made. This is like this is it was like, was it male prostitutes? It was male. I, I didn't I didn't investigate. I'm I don't pretty know. sure they were yeah. doing gay shit. They were doing gay shit, yeah. Pretty cool. Well, that's what they do in Parliament. Yeah, they're, they're, t- they're making bracelets in, in, the, in the Parliament. <laughs> yeah, they <laughs> hired they they a bunch of gigolos over to make friendship bracelets with them and have a sleepover. <laughs> yeah, using duct tape. They oh. talked about, they talked using, about boys the entire time. Using duct tape and friendship bracelets. And they talked about how much they love boys so much. Yeah. 
they're, they're, to- they're talking about their 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 their, their crushes and uh, and playing truth or dare with each other. No, giggling. Yeah. Also, uh, here's something. Uh, I saw Eva and 40X. What does everyone think about fucking 40X? Because I think it's great. I've never done it. I've, I've you been, you I've never been, you never even been, been on the like, like, movie park. Park. Never yeah, been so I, I've been I've been to the journey to the center of the earth uh, 40 experience at Movie World, and that's my that's my cutoff. We gotta go see. We gotta go see Black Adam and Forty X. I'm good. Really? I think you're a coward. I'm good without seeing Black Adam right now. Dwayne Johnson comes on camera. And Dwayne get, like, Johnson. Really. Dwayne. Yeah, Dwayne Johnson. <laughs> the sound. Well, what about White Adam? Adam? I just saw a joke. I'm sorry. What about White Adam? But what about White Adam though? <laughs> what about White Adam? <laughs> So-called free he does make an appearance make original joke compared to fucking a few <laughs> I'm, I'm fucked up. Why does that make me laugh? In the in the in the beginning. In the beginning. In the beginning. I'm pretty sure there's White Adam and Brad. Ty cut out, but I so agree with bro. whatever you just said. There's White Adam and Bro. No, White Adam. <laughs> White Adam and Brown Adam show up apparently. Yeah. Brown. What about brown. what about what about yellow Adam or purple Adam? Or, uh, uh, what, or... what about red what about red Adam? Yeah, yeah. Hey. What about what about blue Adam? That's Shazam. They're, they're the Shazam people. That's awful. Yeah, I forgot that Shazam made a fucking Oh Brown Adam is one of the Shazam kids, I'm pretty sure. Well, why is Black Adam because I mean Black Adam is a brown man, so it is a little bit jarring, don't you think? Okay, see, when I look up brown Shazam, uh, all that comes up is the uh, the Shazam logo, but it's brown. Nice. Yeah. Yeah, that's all that came up. That's so awesome and cool and swag and, and awesome. Okay. Uh... Oh, there is no brown Shazam. There's no brown Shazam? It's gray Shazam. He's gray. Oh, what a shame. Let's make our own, like, Power Rangers-esque team. Robo Cafe, go! But they're all, like, chimpanzees. They're all, no, they're all different types of primates. And they, no, and they pilot a big chimpanzee. But it's, like, organic. It's not like a mech. It's, like, an actual, like, organic chimpanzee. Big organic like, messing with its nerves. Yeah, and and one day the chimp goes berserk and just people and shit yeah. yeah just fucking on yeah i mean you know it's their fault you and know they're pushing well it. the thing is they're also a bunch of chimps in the chimps so it's kind of <laughs> like and then the, the the chimps in the chimps the big chimps start going <laughs> wild and they start you know yeah that's, it's a whole thing and then because the, then the <laughs> chimp starts getting attacked from the the big chimp starts getting like torn apart from the inside as well which only causes it to you know do more go more insane and then it's yeah. Yeah. Guys, look it up. the The chimp event, the 2024. If if you are in that time period, you probably um the government cut tag off. Yeah, <laughs> this is literally censorship from a certain government. It's because my internet say. here is shit. No, the government is the fucking wiretap wiretapping your Bluetooth. Yeah, I feel that. <laughs> uh, where of the chimp event? Yeah. <laughs> Oh, that, that, that is what they're talking about, the random, uh, what's it? Random human? Yeah, random human. Yeah, yeah, but that passed. But it is. And pause. Yeah, but no, yeah. no one, no one talked, no one said there wasn't going to be a random chimp event too. I mean, there's random chimp events every day. I'm, I'm sure chimps do random events. I'm, no, like, I'm, I'm yeah, still. Yeah, but the random chimp event. I'm still pissed off that we never got the May 2021 NYC Heaven Stairway incident. Ah, uh, fuck. I, I, I'm, I'm shattered about that. Wait. You don't remember that? Oh. Is this a timeline merge thing? Is this... Did we... Yeah. Did we okay. converge? Yeah. Damn, that's crazy. This is insane. Damn, rip to those New York citizens, I guess. You guys no one died. They just flew up in the air a bit and then fell back down. It was and pretty underwhelming. Down, yeah. <laughs> the way you, there was only one way to escape it. I heard it was like you fucking uh, to like cover yourself in 
gasoline. Uh-huh. Oil. Oh, yeah. Because it's, so da- it's so dense that it, yeah. you wouldn't let it get oh, you're like, you really bring this meme back? <laughs> <laughs> like, yeah, Wait, oil it. floats on water. Oil's less dense than water. Uh-uh, oh, I don't want to bring it back. <laughs> I can't even... Oh, oil is more dense. It's an old <laughs> meme. You can't fucking remember it. I, obviously, you're the densest fucking out of all of them. Uh, actually, by by actual uh, scientific stuff, you're the densest, Connor. <laughs> Well, actually, uh, you're stupid, so... You probably have the most yeah. muscle. So you wow. Wow. But, but you're, you got heavy set bones. I went, I went, I went lightheaded when I did that for a second. I was like, that was Good. scary. Good? Yeah. What if we made a trap house? How about I fucking kill you, Connor? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm sorry. Oh, yeah? You want a trap? <laughs> Alright. It's fine. All right. Tonight at three in the morning. What if we're three in the morning? What if we're in the morning? Okay. Sorry. Have you guys ever been in a really, really, really scary incident, like situation? Scary. Yeah. Feel free to yeah. tell tell us. Uh, Connor, you've been in something ever ever been in a very spooky, scary situation. You just said yes, so I I, I assume you have a story on the top of your head. Uh. Sorry, I burped. All right, Con- Connor doesn't. <laughs> all, right, all right, can I just? All right, I think I, I think the scariest thing that ever happened to me was like, it was just like uh, I was chased by uh, one of our school bullies. I got expelled, but you know, uh, other than that, I one I once had like uh, see someone a ghost. I I mean, yeah, the skeleton <laughs> jumped out. Me? Skeleton <laughs> jumped out. <laughs> Yeah, actually, it was a skeleton with a, with a cool scimitar came, ran down and chased me. He turned into a... Fuck! Your, your bully's chasing you, and then as you're running, uh, wanted, then he suddenly, your bully just gets decapitated out of nowhere. And then oh, yeah, I also scared... Skeleton of a big horse. <laughs> a second, the second ah. scariest thing that ever happened to me. <laughs> he I'll points at you with his bony finger. Fucking <laughs> 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 Found you. I almost had a close, close encounter with Slender Man, <laughs> so ten years old. My sister. Hmm. Oh, that reminds me of our encounter with Slender Man. <laughs> that does remind yeah. me of Ty's encounter with Slender Man. <laughs> yeah, when J- Jacob. Yeah, yeah, when we lost Jacob to Slender Man, that that's probably yeah. the scariest thing that happened to me. But you know, I guess it more happened to Jacob than it did to me. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> And Ty's good friend Jacob, of course, uh, for, for you know, for the podcast, you he know, was found. He had his clothes off and everything. Yeah, well, yeah, why he went, he went missing for like two weeks straight, uh, and you know, he found his clothes. His, were, his clothes were like left at like a cabin, and his body was just stumped. And, like you, pro- yeah. right, can I just provide context? You you, pro- you said that as, as like kids, like it was like Slender Man. Yeah, we said as kids, our friend Jacob got got kidnapped and killed by Slender Man. I don't see what the what big that was. Wasn't I don't understand what the I don't understand. You said it was like a guy. That well, yeah, of course like... it wasn't actually Slender Man, but yeah, but I, I'm just talking about you know it's it's still hey, scary Slender. on the left. The the it's scary enough that you know our, our good friend Jacob, of course, uh, got got kidnapped and murdered. Yeah, we thought it was Slender Man at the time. We, yeah, we were kids, so we didn't yeah. like. And it was yeah. kind of our fault he got taken. Mm-hmm. To be honest. Yeah. Yeah. I fully believe you when you said that. I fully... You should. It was, it's a hundred percent real. We're not lying, Max. Fuck me. Well, anyway, well, um. <laughs> Other than that, you know, I mean, sometimes I go outside and I'm like, I'm like, it's a bit dark and I see like, like little outlines of like scary people and I'm like, whoa, is yeah. that? But it's oh, just like a shadow. Yeah. I used to I think... that, that I used me to... sometimes. I used to think that when I was younger, I, I guess the music had left like an imprint in my mind but uh sometimes i used to look at the dark corridor and think that like michael jackson from thriller was gonna thriller was gonna turn but i always ima- like gonna turn around the corner and i always imagined though that his skin was made out of like like a like stone like i imagine his skin was like this like hard cement stone and he had like this like fixated like mm-hmm. his face was just fixed you couldn't move it and now I like to imagine that he was around the corner. You just hear like, no, no. Yeah, you're thinking of around Gollum, the corner. Michael Jackson. 
And you're like, oh no, I hear it, it's coming, it's happening. Yeah, just from the... <laughs> Speaking of that, I always like, I, like, I go running at night pretty frequently and I just see crackheads oh. running around my street and that and just... They run? I go around. Yeah, they run. I go around. They run. They run around like scream and shit. Yeah, I go around That's sort of cool. your area at night sometimes as well, and just like run at independent mm-hmm. women. I cover yeah. myself in van to black as well when I do it, so you can see my <laughs> eyes and teeth. That'd be terrifying. <laughs> boys black beards. Right you, you call us. You always do. Like go, deepest, uh, deepest black, blacker than the night. Just, just running at you. Banjo, you're, you're that guy. You're the guy who calls himself the black, and and he and he's running around. They call, call you big black. They call you big black running at me. Oh wait, big black. that sounds horrible. I just realized what. <laughs> Bad. Okay, um, in blackface? <laughs> yeah, oh, you got fucking blackface, dude. If you call yourself in Van de Black, would you get done for blackface, or would it be like yes. the? But, it, but it's for like the jerk. Yeah. If you cover your entire being, including like your hair, your clothes, your entire, your entire body, entire, like yeah, that's what I mean, I'm that's saying. That's like that baby that got covered in tar. He wasn't any blackface. <laughs> I think tar baby is a little bit different. <laughs> crying screaming as he's covered in tar and everyone just goes is that fucking blackface kid F- that fuck fucking... that kid and then they're just filming him getting mad at him posting on tiktok the outrage you know fucking twitter like... this kid's getting so much hate <laughs> he's yeah, so he's like, like, a, like a racist thing wasn't that like the point <laughs> isn't tar baby literally like a slur people use <laughs> Wait, what? Oh my god. Didn't know like, that. I guess no idea. All right, all right, all right, all right, you know how they used to tar people back in the mini old days? Oh, oh like, my god, yeah. it is. That is oh, imagine, imagine they tar, oh my god. tar your, skin's, your skin's burning off, and then there's like, is that fucking blackface, dude? And then like your own guy's oh. telling you. What the fuck? Yeah. I'm yeah, so you're, sorry. You're, you're I didn't know that. You're fucking a castle with your fucking... Why am I being so unintentionally racist? Because you're, old, because, old, you're, because you're old, 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 old. Can we censor that shit? I don't want Well, no, oh. I, but you were uh, talking about an actual tar baby. No, so I was like talking about an actual one. baby coming in the tar. So, yeah, yeah. yeah, I feel like your intentions were different. <laughs> like, this is an actual thing. Like, this is an actual, like, thing that I saw. Yeah, of, like, that you believe. I didn't know that. Yeah, it's the fucking... <laughs> <laughs> it's 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 on the image. <laughs> It, he does get cleaned up, by the way. There is a good ending. To- is he burned? No, he's fine. He's actually, like, absolutely fine. Like, he's fine afterwards. Is he better? He's just got- does, it imp- does it remove impurities? <laughs> does it remove his blackheads? The Tyke posted a picture it of a really baby just, just covered in <laughs> black liquid. <laughs> Is that, I was like, I'm sure, that's not actual tar. It was really good for his scalp health. That's like that's like the uh, like the SCP or was it, what's it, what's it, like the guy that fa- that old man that faces through walls and shit. Can't you know? <sighs> yeah, I know, I know what you're talking about. Oh, this is fucked up. I, 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 I need to play. Some people are making SCP <laughs> containment breach, and I really want to play it because that game seems like a real fun time. The baby looks uh, <laughs> kind of like a like Alec Baldwin at the end of Cat in the Hat when he's covered in like the purple. <laughs> Yes. Yeah. Yes. You get it. Just, just change the goop on in the purple. Yeah, yeah. Just huge just shift it to purple. It. That's just that's <laughs> a little Alec Baldwin. Dude, he's actually just going full. He has full body hockey from One Piece. <laughs> okay, wait, wait to make it cringe, Tag. I've been saying this, you know. Tag's been saying that for years. I've been saying, been saying that that baby has been covered in hockey from One Piece for years. One Piece is a cult i've been saying this for years everyone who reads it it's like yeah no dude you gotta fucking read one piece dude dude i'm on my fucking like like a three read of one piece dude you gotta fucking like it. It. man w- just can you just be like normal one piece is just can you i just think it really attracts a, media, like, a regular person like jesus yeah can you just shit yourself can you just shit your pants and fucking run away from me i don't want to talk to you <laughs> The we're the playing, we're, guys, we're playing a bit where I was going to shit my pants at, at the at the end of this podcast. What, so, oh, you just spoiled it! You just spoiled it. Oh, fuck! I why? Why did you even say that? 
So, what um, I don't know. I, 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 I <laughs> like, what, what, it just, it was half, it was spontaneous. It uh, was like a, it's it's a autism that. spectrum disorder. <laughs> Boom. Look, I'm getting, I'm taking pills for it. It's fine. The autism pill. I took autism pills when I was a kid. It hurt, that's, made my head hurt. That's <laughs> not ha- that, that can't be like a thing. <laughs> it's that's, not, not, that's not. I took exactly. autism. Like my, 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 pe- my pediatrician gave me autism oh, pills. Of course, pediatrician. Pediatrician. Oh, fuck you. Yeah. 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 Yeah, like, they'll give you're me you're headaches like and like really bad actual, head- like, spirit. <laughs> 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 they were erasing parts of your personality. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Taking bits away from you. It's like you know, that was like, awesome. if you got to the end of the treatment, you were just gonna become like gray. You were just gonna turn gray. <laughs> just gray. To become gray. Yeah, gray. Become gray. Become gray. It'd be like those fucking like those like horrible like like uh diet pills from like, the fucking like fifties. I'll just burn holes inside of you. Like, <laughs> so... still doing that to my brain. If you could make any Kingdom Hearts villain real and your roommate, uh, which one would it be? That's kind of hard to put, Demix, honestly. You wouldn't, Demix would you, you, wouldn't, you up all night. You wouldn't just pick straight up Xehanort? I don't know what Demix. Oh, you play the guitar? He's like, I feel like Xehanort would play a lot. He'd be like, bro. I, I feel like Zay- yeah, Xehanort would constantly guitar, try to get out of it. same thing. They're different. Same they're different. They're incredibly <laughs> different instruments. <laughs> I I think Zayn will constantly try to get out of uh, paying yeah. for his for his fucking share. No, like, he wouldn't. Yeah. Zaynor's like an old man. No, he would, he think... would be on you for paying yeah. your rent. Always, that's what I mean. He'd always be on my ass about everything, so I, I just wouldn't want that. I choose Axel. He's not a villain. He doesn't count. All right, all right. I want to. He was wanna, a villain like... for ex- precisely one game. Uh, would you all right? Do you don't. think? Do you think you like? Uh, that's a quick question. Do you think you can trick Demix into saying the N word by accident? Yeah, you probably could. I, I feel like he's going off. Would just to like... say it. <laughs> yeah, what's up? What, what's up, my N word? What's up? I think he would. Demix, just, like, yeah, he comes from Demix, a Disney world. You, you There's can't... no concept of racial. Yeah, he, he would just see it and would think it's like some cool, like, like hip language, and he would just like say. Racism it. doesn't exist in like catch. I mean, it definitely does, I presume, but not, it's not... Oh, yeah, but not between, like... It's not black like, person, white person, racism. It's, like, light and dark. Fucking, it's dance, like, and we're dance! Well, light and dark <laughs> is the same thing, but... No, 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 but I mean, like, the more metaphorical, like, alignments that they have. Okay, yeah, yeah, No, it's yeah, fuck yeah. those trying, cartoon trying motherfuckers. This one. Yeah, I was gonna say, yeah. I think it's fuck more about, like, you know... cartoon motherfuckers. Yeah, it's about the Coming tunes. into my... And frankly, I get it. Fuck Michael Mouse. If you saw Michael hey, Mouse taking are... your job, wouldn't you become racist against Toons? I would. Toon does sound Isn't like that... a slur, doesn't it? <laughs> Fucking yeah, Toon. Yeah, like... You walk into a shop and you see a sign outside, Toons not, Toons not need, need not apply. They wouldn't use it that formally. They'd say no Toons allowed. <laughs> I'm sorry. Need not apply. Yeah. Tunes uh, need not apply. If you could, if, if you could please vacate the premises of my of my establishment, that would be appreciated. Tunes. Oh, indeed. Oh. Oh, 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 of course. What if racist people sound like that? Do you think racism would be think less, po- less popular? Less I think they did popular. sound like that at some point. <laughs> yeah, I think most of them were yeah. racist. Nah, people would have been like, oh, these fucking ninnies don't know what they're talking about. <laughs> a lot of, I think a lot of racist people were, you know, that. That's where, they, it's where it comes See, from. If I had a genie and could make a wish, I wouldn't wish to end racism. I would wish to make racists just have big, like, big huge fucking noses so they just look really funny so yeah. no one takes them seriously so you're saying yeah. that having a large nose is uh funny okay no i mean like you're saying, you're saying that someone yeah. someone is funny yeah. looking if they have a big nose i see okay hmm. you can tell comically large i mean comically large nose i mean comically large nose yeah you have a big comically <laughs> large like huge nose and like they also had to all wear like yarmulkes and shit and no. like <laughs> Fuck off, don't yeah, you? Just... Yeah, you fucking <laughs> racist, alright? That's anti Semitism. Anti Semitism is like racism. It uh, is. Nah, definitely. <laughs> it's, it's different. different. 
<laughs> okay, I include. I, I, then, I then make a point when I'm saying this and anti Semites, so then they know. <laughs> uh, just, just to make sure that it's racist and anti Semites, I see. Or what, do you think a good punishment for like racist? The doesn't want you to I don't know. I don't, I don't know. I, I, know. I didn't hear a word you said. <laughs> oh, sorry. Do you think a good punishment for racists would be to, like, an anti Semites would be to turn them into the race that they are actively hating on? Um, that is pretty good. Uh, yeah. World, it, it probably would think... because it would be like a, it would be like, well, like a movie pl- plot, you know what I mean? Yeah, that's like the Black Bomber. He was uh, he was the first. He was supposed to be the first uh, super black superhero, and he was a very racist uh, white man. But he got a super serum that, when he used it, would turn him black. So the first black superhero was technically a white man. Yes. (laughs) Yeah. (laughs) First. Then they hired someone and said, "This is retarded," and they came up with a with a black superhero who shot light, who had electric powers, and because of uh, because. Yeah, black lining. Sorry, I forgot him. Then, because a lot of people didn't want to pay pay him royalties, they kept making like knockoffs of black lightning that were just black lightning. That's static, how, that, what, static shock. Yeah, I mean, static not static like shock. He's actually different. Thing. It's just there's a lot of just like you know, black lightning but different names. Static yeah, shock, and then probably is... DC bought every single company that had those characters and owns yeah. all of them now. They got Charles and then, and then. Yeah, there's like tw- there's yeah there's like twelve different. There's a lot of characters. <clears throat> There's only been historically the like thing. one comic company that has actually had like good uh like uh characters of who aren't like white, you know. Yeah. I forget what it was, but it was the 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 company that owned Static Shock before um it was yeah, they, the whole thing. Thing. Heard Static Shock. They, they, the whole they actually had good. really g- fucking cool yeah. characters. I thought they were like a various, thing. you know, races and sexualities and shit. Their whole thing was like diversity and stuff like that. So doing characters that were was... no, <laughs> the woke was SJW left. He was just doing characters that were just yeah. written, like not written just as white man or right or like sexy white but big buff white man or like sexy white woman. Mm. So it was like interesting like, how he made the one. distinction between uh how the <laughs> big buff white man isn't sexy. Well, because Tyke's trying to lie, try, trying to trying to oh. lame shade himself about his Michael's... own feelings. <laughs> interesting, yeah, interesting how he made the that that uh, that that point there. That Superman, would, no, no, he's just big and buff. He's not hot, but 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 of course. But... Want me to think Superman's sexy, unless he had pink kryptonite. Yeah. <laughs> don't don't let me do that pink pink kryptonite. I'm gonna act funny. I'm gonna, I'm gonna become. Like, it's gonna so, be like, calm. I no. I have a question. Like, what if you put cr- pink kryptonite next to a gay person? It would they turn just, them straight. It would turn them straight. Is that the it actual thing? It. Yeah. No. What? No. It but it's, it's just it, it, the whole thing is it. Inverts yeah. You put it next to a gay Kryptonian. What? Well, doesn't Barack Obama? Yeah. <laughs> he's a Kryptonian. Yeah. yeah he's a gay oh. Kryptonian. I feel that. <laughs> He just keeps a he keeps a thing of pink kryptonite in his pocket at all times because he doesn't want to uh, jeopardize his image. As you know, Michelle, I uh, Michelle, Barack, keep the Michelle. I'm having few thoughts about men. Obama, I mean, <laughs> Barack, Obama, check your pockets, Barack. Oh shit, the the pink kryptonite, Michelle. I can't find it. Don't worry, I've got some spare it's in his I- pocket. I'm thinking uh, about. I'm, I'm thinking about. Uh, Michelle, I'm, uh, I'm, 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 I'm thinking about a uh, cock uh, right now. Rock becomes that fucking like that image of like the. I was born on crypto. <laughs> Do you think that's why everyone was getting mad at him? <laughs> everyone's like, because you know he's like not fucking. Everyone's like, everyone needs to find his origin and shit like that. It's the crypto, and, and then it finds out he was. Born he said yeah. that. He Obama, said that. Yeah, they were saying Obama's a legal a- alien. He's like, no, I'm like a like a like a planetary alien. Like, I'm, you know. I mean, he he still he's still. Like, oh, I'm not the alien you're you're thinking about. Uh. And then and then he sucks on his uh pink kryptonite, and then puts it back in his pocket real quick. And he says, "I love women." I, uh, to- just just so you know, I I love women. Uh, I uh, I, <laughs> I, 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 I uh, I'm very attracted to women. And I support them. 
what what is this fucking what what did he go did he i'm confused because of the way he's saying it it's like he's well, Bubba said that a reference he was connor linked a, a, a no i'm, news I'm reading the article Obama now. said he was born on krypton yeah i'm reading this article and even the way he says it, it just sounds like he's going yeah i was born on krypton. Wait, okay i was friends with spock so um so uh anyone anyone see that minecraft uh live i did actually I'm I didn't. A fan of the, the did, new yeah. fucking default skins. Yeah, oh yeah, they added a bunch of new default skins. It's kind of cool, I, mean, I guess. It's, it's just like, eh. Yeah, I mean, I mean, it doesn't really change that much, but it's, it's cool, nice. I guess. If you, you know, if you, you don't have to, you know, you can, you can the be new more. Default you know. skins include uh, gay Alex and gay Steve. No, it doesn't have those. <laughs> no, it's Steve, <laughs> but he has a full stop and silver question mark at the end of his name. That's. Nice. Because he's not questioning anymore. Um. So that's real. That's really cool. Uh. Let's let's talk about something else spooky. Just to... You guys ever seen the Nightmare Before Christmas? <laughs> yes. Oh, uh, I want to watch Wendell and Wild. Cool. So. I haven't seen the Nightmare Before I Christmas. So. You haven't? I haven't seen it either. Really? You haven't no, seen you're right. I was talk. lying to you. <laughs> okay. Good. Uh, uh, you're right. I was lying through my fucking teeth. <laughs> Wait, but have any of you guys seen Wendell? And... No. Any awesome. stop motion one? That no, looks pretty good. I'm so hungry. I haven't, I haven't seen, seen the night before Paranormal. Christmas, but I have seen uh, Frank and Weenie. So. Have you seen Paranormal? No. You should. No, but there's a, there's a big buff gay dude in that one. I don't really, you know, vibe with that. Uh, I don't remember. He's a total chick flick nut. Uh, that's yeah. That's that's a cool. That's an interesting little tidbit I had. You know. Yeah, I don't. I don't watch movies. I agree with the statement. Yes, I watched a fucking. Did I ever? <laughs> did I ever go on my blonde rant on the podcast? Or was that no? I watched Blonde with my family a couple of weeks ago. That Marilyn Monroe. I think I did, but that Marilyn Monroe movie and it fucking blew us. It was so ungodly bad. Was it bad in a fun way or bad in? A, it was like, really boring? boring. It was like almost three oh. hours long. Uh, it was like, it was like, it was like a fictional biopic, kind of, where they made up a lot of bullshit about Marilyn Monroe's life, right? Did she eat pizza in bed? No, but the thing is, uh, they, they didn't even make it interesting. It's- like, they had the, they had the, the thing of being like, oh, well, we're like a fictional biop, so we can do whatever the fuck we want. But they just made it, like, the three acts were just, like, first pregnancy, second pregnancy, third pregnancy. It was really fucking boring and just kind of, ugh. It made her look really stupid as well, like ungodly dumb. They also made her call every uh, like husband she had daddy, which is uh, something oh! that we we looked up. But uh, there's no e- evidence of that she ever did that in real life. And so I think the filmmaker that. is just a weirdo. That's so far. Call me, call me daddy, sweetheart. One, it's a boy. One Marilyn Monroe to call me daddy. Come on, sweetheart. So... Call me daddy. Yeah, I respect the hustle. Hey, sweetheart. Dog shit. So dog shit. Yeah, yeah, sweetheart. Oh, don't don't be shy, sweetheart. Then I watch cool. where the crawdads sing. I also night. watched that movie. Where, so That's can you now normal. tell me where do where they the sing? sing the, really... the fucked up thing is I can't because there was a no crawdad in the entire movie. No, oh. no, there was one CGI. <laughs> no. no, there wasn't a single crawdad. Connor, a crawdad is like a crayfish. One CGI oh. crawdad and he, he talks to the camera and his big cartoon eyes and what? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> fucking groovy eyes. I and then wish. he goes, here, this is where I sing. And he starts singing. He starts, he just starts singing. And then everyone just in the audience, I get it now. That's where yeah. they sing. Yeah, that's, yeah. It's like, what does the fox say? That's the entire point of the movie is the main girl is just trying to figure out where the crawdads do sing. And then she finds a little yeah. crawdad sidekick and he's like, oh, whoa. I'm gonna sing I, for you. That movie was paced very weird, especially in the early bits. <laughs> that movie was like f- the most average thing I've ever seen. I just thought it was, there was more. There was more. Like the sex scene was longer than the bit where uh, she, where, where her, her mom walks out on her. 
good. Oh, I fucking love no, but I actually love that fucking scene with a guy where the guy like the guy fucks her and he get, he literally does like three pumps and then he just like he's finished and, he, and, then, and then he's like you'll get used to it. It made me piss myself. It's so funny. Yeah, he's- it makes it sound like really fucking like he did it like really like he, hard. Like he and- thought he was good in the sack. It was like, yeah, no, nah, you'll get used to us. Don't worry. Yeah. God. He just he fucking did it's three like thrusts seconds. and then it finished. <laughs> <laughs> it was so it's fucking pretty- funny to me. Like, like, I don't yeah. think it was meant to be as funny as it was, but it just it was so hilarious. Yeah, yeah, that movie was was I I, I yeah, video. it was like you know it was a movie. Also, like the twist at the end, where like yeah. where she actually did kill the guy, <laughs> it's like it's the most like oh, yeah. okay like. You know? uh, I thought you were gonna say I was I you gonna say she she actually lived. She crawled out the car and then like, <laughs> and then she went off in three pumps. No, the the twist at the end was she was the crawled out the whole time who who was actually meant to be singing. No, the the, the twist where where it turns out the whole movie is around like is 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 around like, like some uh, a guy that she went out with uh, is dead and she is like yeah, on trial guy? for it's a uh, yeah the three pump chump he's he's dead it and is. she's on it trial is. for the murder of him. Uh, and then, and then by the end, she's like proven not guilty, and you like that's the whole thing. It starts, and then she'll like, well, let me explain my story, and then you know, it goes through the whole like backstory of that shit. Story. And then, and then it it cuts to her like winning the trial, and then it like it shows like a montage of her like living her life and being like an old person like with really her old. like with her like <laughs> a, like there's like two guys, and she so she's with like the other guy who wasn't an abusive yeah. rapist, um. And th- and then they like grow old and do whatever, and then she dies as, as like a really old person, and then the guy <clears throat> like looks through like a book she had, and finds like this guy's necklace, which is like proof that she did kill him, and then the movie ends. Yeah, it's like real, like <laughs> it's so stupid. <clears throat> like no, it's it- like it's not like a twist where you're like, oh my god, it's it's more all right, all right. All right. That, that really doesn't matter. It's also because they made the guy seem like the biggest piece of shit that it, like, uh, even if she killed yeah. him, who the fuck cares? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. He was just the worst. Yeah, he sucked like, balls. Like, he like, was awful. Was, like, there's not, he doesn't have a single good trait. No. Hey, except he's really good in the sack. And then, the, <laughs> yeah, yeah, he is, he is a master of hanging dong. You're right. Sure, get used to that. Sure. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And then they played a Taylor Swift song that they got for the movie in the in the credits, and that was the only time it was played in the movie. And I was like, "Why did you spend so much money on this Taylor Swift song?" If, but I guess that's not just that movie's thing. That happens to a lot of movies. When she comes out as gay in it. What? She comes out as gay. Ta- Taylor Taylor Swift. What? Yeah, man. Taylor Swift comes out as gay in it. Why? What does she, that? Lyric when she goes, "I'm gay." Oh, that lyric when she says in the third grade, I thought that I was gay. You're right. I forgot about that line. <laughs> Turns out I am. God damn. When I was in the third grade, <laughs> my dad was talking <laughs> about music the last night. Uh, not last night. A couple nights ago. <laughs> he was trying to like, he was asking us like, uh, like what, 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 a, you know, the kids listen to now. <laughs> the kids listen to. And he to. was like, the, ki- the kids still listen to Macklemore. <laughs> <laughs> I would, I do. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. they still play with Blast and like thrift shopping. What? 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 It's what? Like, so oh, funny. <laughs> I just kind of think the, the, the fucking people in my work. He asked. Talk. He asked if people still listen to Macklemore, and then uh, and we said no. And then he's asked if people still listen to Gautier. <laughs> Gautier made one song, bro. It's, it's like I, <laughs> people haven't li- like no. <laughs> <laughs> it's so Sorry. funny. She said yes. Bring it back to movies. I, I watched Nobody starring uh, Bob Odenko. Mm-hmm. Thought it was cool. He's like uh he's like a cool like uh fighting guy and he fights. He was like, I'm a nobody. And, and, he goes, <laughs> and you he goes, I'm, and I. He goes, I'm nobody and then Yeah, and then the credits when when the credits rolled, it was <laughs> you will go away. 
It's like I'm going to go remix of that. Yeah, mix she, on, like, she on screams. It's like a, a <laughs> remix of that with like mixed with medical. <laughs> That'd be fucking swag who taught on the fucking medical soul thing. Yeah. I reckon you can make a mix of those two songs. Yeah, I wouldn't be bothered though. I wouldn't do it. You don't know how to do it. <laughs> oh, no. I'll get my good friend Lachlan Bond to do it. <laughs> Fully name drop? All right. <laughs> <laughs> You made it sound well. like he wasn't your good friend, or that he's just, <laughs> saying first and last name. What the fuck? Well, <laughs> no, I refer to one of my good friends, Danger. Sounds like someone. He's saying the. He's saying the way. It's like yeah, my good friend Lachlan. Like, yeah. Like, like it's like someone like that's gonna like fucking like like shoot you in the head. And <laughs> he said, it, he it, said it like he's like a late night TV host who has to pretend that like the guest <laughs> is like his like friend. <laughs> now we got my guest. Good friend of mine. <laughs> Falkland Bond. Woo! Woo! Yeah! Woo! Yeah! Yeah! Major, yeah! yeah! <laughs> uh, play that sound effect again. Yeah! yeah! Oh, yes. <laughs> I'm gonna play that sound effect in post. Add it in in post. Yeah. Now, now, add in, add in Louis C.K.'s monologue on SNL. No, no, add in. Now, add in. Add in. I had Lucy K saying the N word. I don't. I, no. <laughs> I'd rather not. Would rather not do that one. Jerry wouldn't like that. <laughs> My good friend Jerry would be. Say that. Like, what? <laughs> Wait, he can say that. What? What? And then oh. Ricky Gervais gets in on it too. Oh, of course he can fucking say it, Jerry. <laughs> of course he can fucking say he's a fucking legend, Jerry. <laughs> That's my Ricky Gervais. Hey, I like it. Of course he fucking shit. It's just a fucking word, Jerry, isn't it? It's just a fucking word. <laughs> hey, how are you? It's just a fucking word. It reminds me of like it's a fucking word, isn't it? It's just a fucking word, isn't it? Ricky Gervais reminds me of like a dad on his dad. It's funny because they don't, because they've got a penis. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's pretty his, cool. That's his comedy now. And Lucy is like, yeah, yeah, um, I said the N word, huh? <laughs> Yeah, yeah, I just said the N word. Yeah, so what? Jerry Seinfeld's in there like, uh, huh? What the crap? What? He said I said Rogan. He just said the N word. You can't say that. You can't do it. You can't can't say the N word. You can't do it. He has flashbacks where, uh, (laughs) so like, like you see, like, the, it's fades in of of the the law factory. You see Kramer in his eyes and the reflection of his glasses. Lightning bolts and rain going off. It's like, oh no. yeah, stormy night approaches. Ah! Uh, you guys see that clip of a of a of Bob Odenkirk's like a, a weird a uh, weird uh, parody of a uh, of, of 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 Beat It. Yeah, yeah, uh, yeah. Where where all the all the cast of Better Call Saul and Breaking Bad or whatever come in and like finish it, and then Jack Black is also just there in the middle for some reason. <laughs> David Cross and stuff. It's to make fun of the, the the people, the celebrities that did that that other thing during the pandemic. That's literally yeah, what that was. Imagine. It was yeah. Imagine. It was David imagine. Cross and Paul <laughs> Rooney did it to like make fun because they were doing it for an actual charity. Yeah. Thing. So they were just making fun of it. Fucking love Jack Black. <clears throat> you know his name's like Jacob, I think. Name's Jacob. Jacob Black. Do you guys know? Okay, here's the thing. Do you guys know that Emma Stone's name is just is Emily? Hey, I'm Emily Stone. <laughs> what? Like, um, why the fuck would you? I don't understand. Because right, there are celebrities who like change their name, right? For like Hollywood like, or whatever. And it's, u- it's usually for like notoriety or like there's another person called that, or they you know that it's they sound too ethnic was one. Uh, but like, yeah. there's genuinely like it's usually like a reason. And shit that people do it, so they have like a you know like a stage name, which like sounds yeah, like the name sounds more like memorable and stuff. But like Emma Stone, I don't, I don't, I fundamentally do not understand why, why, like, why the fuck is Emily Stone like not? It's because um, Emily Stone was already another. So she she may she did Emma Emma Stone so she wouldn't be confused. 
What was there? Yeah, that's what it says here. Apparently. But if when I if I Google Emily Stone, I just get Emma Stone. So like, what? I think I think huh? it's either this. Uh, I don't know actually. Yeah. Apparently, it says that, but it also says that. See, in this one, it was. Uh. Came, it came from the Spice Girls. Because Emma Bunton. Oh. I don't know, man. This, That's I, a very normal reason. That's the other one I like a lot is uh whose real name uh Travis Scott's real name. His name is yeah. Jacques Berman Webster the second. Yeah, Jacques, I can see why I want to change that. Jacques Berman yeah. Webster the second. But the thing is, I don't get what Travis Scott is like. He's like a rapper, so it's like. You know, a lot of hip like hip hop artists, they don't go by like na- like he chose a stage name that's just like a guy's name. That's true. <laughs> yeah. Like, why would I don't get it? You could it's choose like, anything because that space it's like normal to have like a stage name. Like if you're an actor, yeah. it's like it's like not many. It's you like weird normal if name. you had like a stage name, but like for like you know, fucking no one's questioning Snoop Dogg and why he doesn't go by his name. Like he's just known as fucking Snoop Dogg. He's fucking snooped up. So I don't get why why Travis Scott he just chose just like just like a just a name. I think it was like inspired by some like people, but still, it's just it's just so boring. What is Snoop Dogg's real name? It's I have no fucking idea. Calvin Cordo Zar Broadus Jr. Calvin Cordo Zar Broadus. Yeah, that's the thing. I had no idea, so that that goes to show, like, who the fuck, just you know, you can you can have like a cool name, you know. And if you if you you can, why wouldn't you? Yeah, but but you just choose to be Travis Scott. It's just like a just like a regular dude name. Yeah. If if Snoop Dogg was an animal, he, like, like I guess if he was a dog, he'd look like a little. What? Wow, like one of those little bug eyes. You good? Oh, wow, dude. See, okay. Oh, you good? Oh, I just died on, on call. It's all good. Uh, you see, the rapper said, the name Travis is an ode to his I'm uncle. Like, I'm like actually a bit worried about calling him. <laughs> no, dude, it's okay. <laughs> the great, I don't know. Room is fallen. Well, I haven't responded yet. I'm a bit worried. It's a sp- Oh... And then Connor? Scott comes also from the uncle. Holy shit. So you okay? Yeah, just a massive fucking co- like flying cockroach flew right like right behind from behind my head in front of my face. That's Halloween, baby. Connor sitting there Halloween. like he's right behind me, isn't he? Spooked you. Yeah, so Travis Scott's stage name is just named after his uncle. That's sweet. I mean it's kinda neat, I guess, but it's just it, it's weird. You know, I don't have a favorite uncle. Even if I did, I don't know if I'd choose my personality to be based off my favorite uncle. My, my I mean, lovely uncles. Also, apparently Travis was his name and Scott was his nickname, so he's just called, like, his uncle's name twice. And then, also, he then he gets more popular using that name than his uncle, so now everyone's calling him his uncle's name. But, like, what would his uncle think about that? Maybe he's cool with it, and he could say he's Travis Scott, and since he's his uncle, uncle probably looks pretty, like, not that different. Probably. It would probably be like, he, w- he really wouldn't mind, but it, uh, there'd be a little bit of resentment where it'd be like, oh, the kid's literally, like, that's my, that's me. I'm Travis Scott. <laughs> I'm the real Travis Scott. Yeah, that oh. kid's, that kid's Jock Berman Webster the second. Guys, it's funny. Anyone with a, the second in there? Anyone like with a with an <laughs> I I at the end of their name is so fucking awesome. I agree with this name. You're not me. If I ever have a child, I'm gonna I'm gonna give him a a, a second at the end of his name, even if, but I'm not gonna name him like after anyone <laughs> in, in specific. It's just like gonna have a completely unique name, which is gonna be and the second. I, I, at the I'm. End. I'm, I'm... I'm qu- I'm qu- quite partial to the four. Should we all name our kids the same name and just add numbers? <laughs> <laughs> if you name your kid so Martin the second. Cruel. I name my kid Martin the third. Yeah. Yeah. So genius. Like, all like, no, we'd yeah. have to choose a gender-neutral name though if we did that because we don't know how it's gonna oh, yeah, you know, play, yeah. play so, like, out. 
Jesse had that all the time. Yeah. Hey, Mr. White. Mr. Hey, White's bitch. bitch. I started watching Mr. Maniac White. with Jonah Hill and Emma Stone. Good show. Fucking crazy, Good man. Show. Fuck yeah. me, am I right? I watched Fuck it because I, I watched Superbad. <laughs> And then I was like, I finished Superbad. I've seen Superbad like a billion times, but I just watched it again. And then I, I was like, uh, I was like, I just, I just thought about what's that other thing that you know that Jonah Hill and Emma Stone were in. So then I just watched, start watching Maniac, dude. Those fucking ad things, like the the like thing where you don't have to like pay for shit and you just get like a person to come and read you ads, like. Some of the cool, like that's such a sick idea. Why don't we do that in real life? What? All right, good conversation, I guess. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. Know. Yeah. Explain, yeah. explain the idea. So there's like a uh, there's like instead of paying with like cash or credit or whatever, you can just like you can. It's, I think they're called ad buddies or some shit, and you just like you just can say like yeah, I'll pay with with the ad thing, and then. What happens is just like someone who works for this company comes to you and just starts, it just reads a bunch of ads to you until you've like paid, paid off. off. Yeah, however much, you know, that thing costs. I mean, that, that might take a fucking long time depending on what you buy. Yeah, but I mean, anything under like, I reckon anything under like 50 bucks, I would just, I would just never spend over that, you know? Like, if that was a thing, I would just be getting ad, I would just be getting people to read me ads constantly. Yeah, because like, why? Well, there's no penalty. I mean, what's the rates? I don't know. They don't go into depth. Oh, wow. I don't fucking know. They don't. They don't go into exact detail about the fucking ad rates of of the maniac universe. It's fairly inconsequential to to the main story. It just it just was a thing in like the first couple episodes. I, I might have to watch this show. What's it on? Netflix. On Netflix. Netflix. On Netflix. It's a good show. I watched it with my mom. It was cool. Yeah, Jonah Hill. You know, that skinny, uh, that ex-fat guy, neck, uh, loose skin, you know? Is this one he's, yeah. like, tanned as? Or is this, like... No, he's, he's pretty... He's, like, normal tanned. This one he's, like, beach guy now, and he's, like, all on the... He's no, he's just, he's just regular Jonah Hill looking. He's not beach guy Jonah Hill, because beach guy Jonah Hill is, is kind of fat. Or he's sort of in between. Like, he's not, like... Okay, stop. No, I mean, Beach Guy Jonah Hill, like, he's not, like, super, like, watching his, like, way trying to be as, like, thin as possible or whatever. He's just, like, he's, he's just being, like, an, you know, natural. Yeah, he's living his best life, Natty. But I mean, like, he was, like, he was, like, thin for the for, for Maniac. Natty Daddy. Like, he was proper, proper skinny. Proper skinny mate. Me, me, Jane, Jane fucking oh. loves proper fucking skinny mate. A proper twiggy. He's proper fucking, twi he's fucking, he's fucking weight on him, he's fucking. He's nothing, he's a fucking skinny little, little, little lad, fuck, fuck. Do you hear that? No. Oh, fuck. Oh my god. It's Mr. Ghost. <laughs> ah! Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Mr. Ghost. What's who? I don't know you, Mr. Ghost. What's uh, what's it's your deal? Mr. Ghost, yeah. What's going on? I don't like you know me. You know me. I, just, I don't, know. I think I've, I don't think we've met, Mr. Ghost. What? It's Mr. Ghost. Ask what me anything. You, what do you do, Mr. Ghost? I uh, I run a digital currency. Yeah, that's your entire job. Crypto market's yes. pretty shit right now. You you doing all right? It's a lot of work, man. There's a lot of I hope you invested in you know, some other some other things. Yeah, that aren't yeah. Just crypto, because yeah, I, I mean everything's down in general. Yeah, I, I do. The hardest, but I don't think yeah. I need someone else telling me how to do my job. And anyway, um, okay, all right. It was just yeah. <laughs> all right, it was just some anyway. Um, um, yeah, I run a digital currency. Doing? It's uh, BooCoin. BooCoin. Okay. BooCoin. Yeah. Okay. I'm not really yeah, into um, crypto, so but that's cool. That's good for you. Uh, I guess. I, I can get you into it, man. No, you, I, give me ten minutes. I'm good right now. Okay. Uh, what are you guys it... talking about? Oh, uh, we were just talking about like skinny Jonah Hill and like you know, oh, scoop uh, spooky shit. I remember that guy. The kinda... uh, last movie he made right was Super Bad. I think that was when I was alive. Yeah, oh, right. Yeah. He... Good movie. Okay. <laughs>
Yeah. Good Remember talk, the, like, Mc, the McLovin joke? Like the, yeah, that's. What, yeah. so are you, so you're up to date, so you make crypto, but all your, <laughs> all your pop culture relevancy is still based oh, well, around like 2007. When, I, when, when your friend, when your, your friend here, he released me from the, from the, the tomb I was, I was uh, sealed away in. Uh, I, I gave me some time and I, I learned about crypto. That's all really. Oh. He gave me, yeah, I, all right. I didn't, he didn't really, he just gave me like a, the thing, you like an iPhone and just said here, uh, <laughs> Figure it out. Five. So, uh, yeah, I got really into crypto, and that's all. Yeah, I guess I've didn't have time for movies. You know, movie. I don't have time yeah. for things like movies. I'm working on this digital currency. You know, I'm working really hard on it. I, it, yeah. Yeah, it very trying to get it, I guess. Yeah. Trying to get it, it off the ground. Base for it your own chain. Yeah. Huh? Connor, why, why have you gained an accent? What? You have pause to possess as well. <laughs> oh, fuck. What? 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 What was it like, hey man, what, is it like, is it on your own chain or like, what's the deal, man? Uh, Did I say that? I'm on chain, Holy yeah. shit, I actually am fucking possessed. <laughs> Boot ya. It's on my own chain, yeah. It's on your own, so you're on your own yeah, um, blockchain. You put it yourself? Do you guys mind if a I, whole uh, new block? Just, well, oh, that's pretty impressive. Well, I want, ghosts, I, want, I want ghosts to be able to partake on it too, so you need to create an entirely new blockchain to allow mm-hmm. us beings from the afterlife the server cost for that because i got um, to no movie small do you guys mind if i like uh promote some stuff i mean uh, I, go have for a podcast. I, have a, I have a podcast that um oh uh, yeah yeah what's, it's uh what's his name what's my pot uh it's uh <clears throat> that's it yeah mm-hmm. <laughs> sorry i was just looking i like for the it. name I like the mist- name. Uh, it's a uh, ghost and grind, basically. Ghost. Okay. I, so it's like a it's like a business podcast. Yeah, we talk about business, but we also talk about. We? You have a co-host? Yeah, I got a co-host. Yeah, oh, that's cool. Is he yeah, also a ghost, buddy. or is he? Uh, yeah, he's a ghost as well. Okay. Yeah. So you're Mister Ghost. But, so, but, yeah. Is that just like a is that just like an unfortunate that's my last, name? That's my last name. My last name. Is that just like an unfortunate? Last name, like were you, were uh, you ghosts, always Mister Ghost. Well, uh, once all ghosts become ghosts, their last name becomes Ghost. So you're all related, or you just all have? No, the we're same... not all related. It's so, just so wait. So what's the point of cha- changing? Do you just forget your last name, or just becomes Ghost? Yeah, get your last name. It's a little bit weird, don't you think? My family comes from a long line of ghosts. I don't know, man. You tell me. Ghost. You're alive, man. You tell me. All right, I just think it's a little bit odd, but that's neither here nor there. Yeah. I guess. Well, yeah, you won't think it's odd when you're fucking dead, man. Okay. Yeah. You guys are fucking assholes. I, all right. Well, I, you're, you're, I, I never you're really insulted. Wanted. I was just, I was genuinely curious <laughs> about. You guys, are personal attack, fucking attacking me. Oh, oh, now you sound triggered here, dude. Now hang on here. Now, now oh, you oh, sound like an you? SJW soy boy here. Now hang oh, on here. Guys. Are you wearing a bracelet right now? Now hang on here. You sound like you haven't had enough stew intake. Who are your boys like right now? Get some stir. Get some stir. Fills me out of the guts for it. Fuck no, he's a ghost. The stool just go right through him. No, that's why he's so beta. This is how this was as well. Stay of time. Fucking beta. I'm not fucking beta. You fucking. Mm. Yeah, then eat some stew. Oh, fucking shut up. Then eat some stew. Show me some stew. Show me me that stew, baby. (laughs) Show me that stew. All right, fucking. I'm about to do a poltergeist on this shit. Fucking poltergeisting this shit. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah, you're gonna use your telekinesis to fucking wear a bracelet. I'm about to ghostbusters this shit. I'm about to bust some ghosts. I have a fetish for Hey, that's dead. me, Slimer. <laughs> Fuck you, Slimer. You don't represent oh, oh, I, oh, I'm just me, Slimer. <laughs> Fuck you, Slimer. Okay. You don't speak for any of us. Oh, I'm sorry, I'll leave. Up. I'm sorry. <laughs> God, what an asshole. Fuck this. Everyone That's listening, go shit. find the Ghost and Grind podcast. Uh-huh. You can find it on Apple, uh, Apple Podcasts, Spotify, YouTube. Uh, it's growing. Um, I'm also trying to get a little startup going. i um, looking for people to sign up for that now. It's $50. $50 to sign up. You learn how to make money, how to do it right from the best, the ghost. So uh, that's there if you guys want it. You know, I also have a course that teaches you how to drop shift. Listen to shift. stuff that helps you, unlike this, this fucking shit, man.
All right. Yeah, you didn't, I, I never yeah, insulted I your thing, and uh, I feel like you came here I and never, you've, you've just started insulting you out. Have, you started out. You didn't have to say anything. Aggressive, like, I could you tell you, you guys were being wanna... passive aggressive. You guys are making fun of me, making fun, of me, questioning me I was... when I clearly know what I'm doing. Okay. I never. I was just. I was genuinely curious, but you know that's fine. I didn't know what I'm fucking doing. Man. If you want to be triggered and interpret everything as an attack, I guess that's all. I'm fucking triggered. I'm not fucking, fucking triggered. W Yeah. I'm fucking triggered. Fuck you guys. You're like you're like the redhead girl who was screaming. You're literally like the fucking pink SJW right now. Yeah, Fuck off. Dude, dude, Isn't it really dude. fucked up that that person never actually screamed? What a fucked up that you sound like the red SJW right now, literally, Connor. Like what you're whining, dude. <laughs> okay, uh, I'm about to end this episode, but real quick, uh, who who would win in a fight? The Terminator or Red SJW? Uh, which which Terminator? Red SJW, of course. Yeah, which Terminator? Are we talking about like that that we're one? Still here, uh... Ghost? Yeah, I thought. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> What? I thought you hated Wait. us. I thought you were gone. No, you uh, just got to go. Oh, no, I, I don't hate you guys. You guys hate me, but yeah. Okay, who would win? The Terminator or fucking Caillou? Uh, I think Caillou. <laughs> Caillou has cancer. What are you talking about? Yeah, that kid's dead. He now. doesn't have cancer, but he also. He, cancer. No, he doesn't. What? Dude, he's, he's a ghost. He's a ghost. He died. Cancer. Exactly. He's a ghost. Connor's just so guy. Connor's just such a contrarian that I that I that I say who will win the Terminator versus a a a toddler bald child and he's like yeah obviously the toddler bald child like, yeah. dude quit being a fucking contrarian ass no no I agree be contrarian man don't worry about what people say because you are in control of your destiny and I think you'd be great fifty dollars you come on. We give you right, money. I'm not letting you say more of this. I can Thanks for drop. listening to the Robo Cafe podcast. I can teach you how to drop ship. I can teach you how to drop ship. Hope you guys are scared. I'm going to fucking hate editing this one, but uh, we'll, uh, we'll, uh, uh, fuck!